A very good morning, dear children. Welcome to class 2, subject EVS. So children, part 1, chapter 14, air and water, I have explained to you. So I am going to recap the lesson and ask you some question answers. Are you all ready? Okay. So what is called wind? Moving air is called wind. What is called strong? When air comes with great force, it is called a strong. What is called a breeze, children? Pleasant, slow, blowing wind is called breeze. So that is cleared. Now, uses of air. We need air to light a fire. We need air to fill balloons. Then it can move a kite or a wind mill. I'm just recapping the lesson for you to understand again. Okay, once more I'm repeating. So dirty air and clean air. Dust, smoke and germs make the air dirty. So what make the air dirty children? Dust, smoke, germs make the air dirty. So children, we should avoid breathing in dirty air. So grow more plants, use a handkerchief while you are sneezing. Do not sit with people, those who are smoking. So that is clear. Now we can come back to our lesson, water. Now part two, water. So children, water is very important in our life. It is very part in our life. So water is very precious. All living things need water to live. So children, water is the very important in our life. So, why is earth called the blue planet? Earth is called the blue planet because three-fourth of the earth is covered with water. So, earth is called the blue planet. So, why is earth called the blue planet, children? Earth is called the blue planet because three-fourth of the Earth is covered with water. So, it is called the blue planet. So, that is clear. Next, name some water bodies. Children, seas, oceans, rivers, ponds and lakes are some water bodies. Name some water body, children. Seas, rivers, lakes, ponds are some water bodies. So that is clear children. Now, what are the uses of water? So I told you all living things need water to live. Water is very important part of our life. It is very important for humans, animals and plants. So children, now what are, I am asking you this question, what are the uses of water? So water the uses for drinking, bathing, cooking, washing utensils and to wash our clothes. So water is very important for us. It's a part of our life and water is very precious. So that is clear, clear children. Then turn your next page. Animals to need for water, for drinking and bathing. Plants need water for preparing their food. Animals need water for drinking and bathing. And plants need water for preparing their food. <laughs> so children, I will explain to you water. Now watch the video and read the lesson. Okay, till now. Bye.